We are PC and M. We are project, change, and process management. At the service of your vision. We adapt and tailor best practices to deliver solutions to operations and capital projects. For PC and M, your vision is our vision. Welcome to our informative essay, Project Management and Change Management, How Do They Correlate? While project management has been an established discipline for many decades, change management is a new and emerging discipline. As a short definition, change management is a comprehensive, cyclic and structured approach for transitioning individuals, groups and organizations from a current state to a future state with intended business benefits. How change management fits within the project management frame is evolving and we'd like to make a small contribution to its understanding. Our informative essays are oriented to provide information and contribute to the fostering of best practices without the intention of prescribing solutions. Now, let us proceed to our presentation. To have an overview of the relationship between change and project management. We are here, on the top, plotting project management group of processes against groups of project and change management activities on the left. We also have a group of activities that may belong to change or project management. And we are naming it as interface. At the initiation stage, and within project management, we must understand the need of the project. We must create and have a project charter approved. We must have our stakeholders identified. In the interface, the definition of strategic objectives comes together with design of a strategy to realize the benefits of our project. The question to ask is, what's the intended benefit of the project? It is important to say that many projects fail just because the intended purpose of the project is not achieved. For change management, understanding the need is also important. Organizational readiness will tell us how far we are from the desired state and how complex is the endeavor in front of us. We also need a change strategy that encompasses stakeholders, communication, and risk management, among others. It's simple. We cannot have a plan without a strategy. Now, we are in the planning group or processes. Typically, project management will prepare and approve a plan that will include scope management, time and cost management, quality, communications, and risk plans among others. In change management, the team must create momentum and embed actions that facilitate the change and break resistance. The creation and communication of a shared vision is one of the enablers of that momentum. Many projects underestimate the required resources for the change. This is the time for a suitable estimate. And of course, we need a change management plan that will be supported by our strategy that will include communications, initiatives, and risk among others. At the interface, integration of the strategy for benefits realization and ensuring plans have integrated the business objectives is a key for success. The questions here are, are the change and project management plans aligned with the strategic objective? Will the business intent of the project be accomplished? If the answer is no, you need to adjust the plan. At the execution phase, the plan is executed along the project in both project management and change management. While project management focuses on deliverables, change management must keep the momentum alive. Here the vision is adopted by the team with the facilitation of change management. During this stage, it will be common to see team buildings and celebrations of accomplishments. Communicate and communicate again and again, there is not such thing as excessive communication. At monitoring and control, the whole team is monitoring the execution and make corrections to the plan as needed. In change management the main action is to keep the vision alive. At the interface, it will be important to checkmark the project is aiming to deliver the realization of benefits, the objectives, and its business intent. Be confident and critic, but be proactive. Now we are at the closing phase. During closing and even before, project management is focused on transferring the projects to the operation. Change management must ensure the new way of doing things is integrated into the culture, especially if this is a process transformation project. 
At the interface, a verification that the project objectives are met is required. It is time to taste the success of our project. Congratulations, a project has been completed. Whether a new facility or industrial building, a new ERP, a business transformation or new software has been delivered. The organization must be in position to enjoy the benefits of the endeavor, and the benefits must be sustainable in time. At this time, you should be enjoying the results of a good strategy, good planning and impeccable execution. Our question should be, is the vision of the project now a reality? Change management should be focused on reinforcing good new behaviors that will allow the change to stick. We must remember, projects where sponsors are deeply involved during the all phases of the projects, are more likely to succeed. We are placing the sponsor very close to this interface, thinking the sponsor will support the full integration of the project. And finally, we would like to express that around the project world, low performance of projects has a very high cost. The 2020 pulse of the profession from PMI revealed an average 11.4% of investment is wasted due to poor project performance and organizations that undervalue project management as a strategic competency for driving change, report an average of 67% more of their projects failing outright. Project and change management consulting may help your company to develop the capabilities and capacity for driving change. Thank you.